So on a rare occasion, you need to change the database name. So for example, this is YouTube, but you really wanted it to be Google. So for that, we can, what we can do is we can tell what we're doing. Uh, we are get altering something, but we are altering database. Which one? YouTube. Now what we're doing, we are modifying something. What? What we're modifying? The name. So it knows the old name is YouTube. So for new one, we can put Google. We hit enter and execute. It says database name Google has been set and it's YouTube here. But if I were to, it shows Google here now. But because we're working in this one and we change the name, if I refresh it, it's Google.